2023. What a roller coaster. Yeah, we definitely had our ups and downs. <laughs> yeah. This is Jason McKean with Mountain Tactical. This is Jeff with Mountain Tactical as well. Did you forget who you are for a sec? Well, I, I thought you were going to introduce me, but hey, we can No, man, going. we're just going to, okay. we're just, you know. Sounds good. All right. You're your own man. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. All, All right. right. So, um, <laughs> yeah, seriously, it was, it was, it was a roller coaster. So, um, I can confidently say 2023 changed our business permanently and, yes. um, and for the, for, for the good. So, I mean, beginning of the year, I mean, we were on a high, I mean, SHOT Show 2023, we were, uh, we formally announced our partnership with Beretta USA. Beretta owns Tika and Saco and multiple other brands. And we were uh, providing our parts for their pro shop. So really cool announcement uh, at SHOT Show. And then um, we have other collaborations uh, that we have started in 2022, going through 2023. We can't yes. wait to tell you guys about. Hopefully we're gonna be launching that here pretty dang soon in 2024. And uh, so SHOT Show, man, we were just... We were rocking riding, and rolling. We were rocking and rolling, riding yeah. a high. We were, you know, everything was good. Life was good. And I came back from SHOT Show one day early, oh boy. walked into the machine shop, and everyone was making fishing nets. Needless to say, we're not a fishing company. We don't have that as our part of our product line. And... Um, and I wasn't feeling good that day anyways. I was just kind of poking my head in uh, to see what was going on. And <clears throat> had a pretty good case of the vid. So um, I was li- obviously, I left the shop pretty pissed off, uh, shut everything down, and um, got home, found out I had a pretty good case of the vid. And um, my foreman, shop foreman, was coming back from shot show the next day. And I was like, no big deal. I'll stay home and rest and yes. I'll let uh, him take care of it. Well, come to find out he was part of this. And while I had been traveling, working on all these different collaboration projects and getting all these other really cool products uh, lined up for you guys, um, they were running a little fishing supply company out of here with our machines, with our equipment uh, and everything. And so, um, unfortunately, he, he, he was kind of leading the pack. Yeah. Um, so anyways, uh, during that week while I was uh, sick, they trashed the place. They uh, damaged machines, destroyed fixtures, uh, basically ruined tooling, just trashed the shop. Uh, I got back. Obviously, we cleaned house. And honestly, Jeff, I think you were the only team member left pre-2023 yeah. yep. cleanup. Yes, and uh, to, to say that that was uh, stunning, not only from your standpoint, from my standpoint as well. I was here the whole time during 2023 SHOT Show. I had no idea what was going on. Um, well, and you're in a completely different part of the building. You're yeah. handling customer service, fulfillment. Yeah. You're on the fulfillment side of the business. Correct. You really don't You don't migrate over to the production no. side of no. the uh on the business. So, um, quite a few F bombs. Uh, needless to say, uh, it was shocking, but I came up with the terminology, you know, for anything to grow, whether it's a snake or a business, sometimes you have to shed skin to grow. And that's exactly what transpired at the beginning of 2023 for Mountain Tactical. At the point in time, we thought it was a back step taking a step back, but we were actually moving forward. So needless well, to, to say, perfect, it was a good thing. Well, and, well, to be perfectly honest, I mean, it didn't feel like it. I mean, no. we, the train went off the rails. Um, yeah. yeah. We had conversations like, do we just shut the whole thing down? Yeah. Um, yeah. Do we outsource manufacturing? Yeah. Do we um, basically, yeah, just, just call it quits. And we had... Uh, long and hard discussions about that. Yes, we we started, uh, but we decided, I don't know, we're probably too dumb to quit. Uh, <laughs> and, 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 and in all seriousness, I mean, it was, it was your guys' encouragement uh, yes. that kept everything uh, moving forward and gave us the drive and determination to fix this. And so we literally started on with 
one product, one part of the shop, and just rebuilt all of our processes, sort of yes. rebuilding our team. Uh, finding better ways to make things. It was a great opportunity, like you said, kind of shedding the skin, yep. letting, letting that new skin uh, come out. And so uh, we cleaned up a lot of processes that were broken. We, yes, they were. Um, had the opportunity to refine products that we have been making for a long time that, I don't know, we were probably just resting on our laurels. So I think, I mean, it, it was a very, very hard time period. We had five months where we had no product going out the door. We had, uh, we blew deliveries um, with Beretta. We blew yep. deliveries with uh, customers. We had, we literally had no product to ship because um, we had sabotage machines. We had to repair. We had to rebuild all of our tooling uh, to make product. We had to um, reprogram everything. I mean, it was a daunting task. And that, for that five months, it was bleak. It was, it was one of those things um, where, like, okay, we just got to put in our, our 20-mile marches and uh, we, we had a quote from John C. Maxwell we kept yes. um, repeating to each other, which is, we're not down, we're either up or we're getting up. Correct. And that was our mantra in 2023. And here, here's the amazing thing. You guys like supported us and encouraged us through yeah. this whole process. You guys um, kept feeding us with uh, that, those positive vibes, positive, positive energy and I hate, I hate talking about stuff like that, but, um, you know, I like staying objective, but it truly was, um, your guys' encouragement that, uh, allowed us to power through everything. And so we are now actually at, by the end of 2023, by the time you're watching this video is 2024, we're making more product yes. than we ever have. Um, we're going to finish 2023, the banner year. Yeah. With a new team. Yes. With new processes. Mm -hmm. Um and it's 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 been an it's been a it's been a journey. Uh we're still not off the roller coaster yet, but no. um I gotta say we have some really cool new gear for the new year. Yes. Uh that we're we have lined up for you guys. And honestly, it's it's amazing just thinking almost a year ago we were just thinking of shutting everything down. We and, were that close. We definitely were that close. Yeah. But we didn't yeah. give up. We didn't give up. Retreat, hell, we just got here, right? Yeah. That was, <laughs> that was the only thing you kept, kept saying. So one of the best things that has happened in 2023 is our new team members. Yes. I mean, we had the opportunity to bring on some, some great, great people. And Colin's behind the camera right now. Say hi, Colin. <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, he's he's been doing our assembly. He loves video editing and putting all this stuff together. So uh, he has told me that we absolutely have to do more videos in 2024. It's been something I know we've been saying forever we need to do more videos, but I think Colin's going to get us there um, since he loves editing yeah. all that stuff. Uh, Thank so God. This is, right? <laughs> so uh, that's, that's going to be awesome. Um, new people on the production floor. Yes. I mean, and people who are passionate about firearms, about doing a good job. Uh, they're not spoiled rich kids uh, that uh, we hired that, you know, are trying to work their own angle and Angle and of the dangle. And, and the they, thing about it is with Mountain Tactical, and I know you'll back me up on this, is I tell people when they're in the interview process that don't come here for a job. This is a family here. And it is a lifestyle. And if that's not your thing, don't waste your time or our time. But we have I think we've got the right people in place. I think we do too. And uh, we're looking forward to it. It's going to be fun. Well, and with the kind of new blood in here, we've been able to bring in some new technology. Yes. So uh, we had, well, actually last summer, so mm -hmm. over a year ago, about 18 months ago now, uh, we had purchased a 21 station pallet pool machine, five axis pallet pool machine that... Um, was going to be our first foray into automation. Yes. And the previous guys never used it. No. I mean, it was a massive investment. So we've been able to get that up and going, which is one of the reasons why we've been able to get so much product out this final quarter of 2023. Um, again, yes. it was been, been incredible how fast we've been able to get the product out. Um, we're revamping our magazine manufacturing process. Uh, so we're actually going to uh, uh, 
we we purchased a robot, so more yeah. more news to come uh, there. We haven't; it's not installed yet, but uh, that's going to be. Or you guys keep buying magazines, so we got to we've had to figure out how to how to run three yes. shifts, and, exactly. And we are in a remote location in Montana, you know, so yes. uh, getting employees is is very very difficult. So um, we've gone the uh, the robotic route, and we plan on making these uh, magazines, you know, three shifts a day. Um, via robot. Yes. And the cool thing about that is um, that means more skilled labor. Yes. It means higher paying jobs, which is good because this is a very expensive place to live. Yes, it is. And uh, we're creating more opportunities for the, the local community. Just also wanted to tell you guys that we will be at SHOT Show in 2024. Uh, look forward to hopefully you guys can come up, meet us, greet us. Uh, hope to be out at range day. I don't know if you'll be out there or whatnot, but love to put a face with a name. If you want to come up, talk to us. I'm, we are always open to new suggestions. You guys are the ones out on the field. Okay. We're here for you. If you have any ideas, please give me a call, shoot me an email, come up to shot show. Love to meet you. Hey, maybe we can have a cigar. Cigar sounds pretty good, man. I'm ready for one right now. <laughs>